some of you heard uh, Valve recently, not recently, like almost a month ago, released a new update with the famous R8 revolver that everybody was crazy about. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to talk about that. As well as revolver, Valve introduced us with more great things. Um, great, yeah. They gave us the game state integration. Uh, I saw a few guys made some crazy shit. Some of some of them made Philips Hue lights uh, that are controlled by C4 timer. Uh, one of the guys made also I think Philips Hue lights that responded to a kill. And there was one guy that I branched out on GitHub who made an Arduino based seven segment display. Uh, yeah, Arduino Bit 7 segment display bomb timer, which showed the countdown of a C4. So, quietly for two weeks, I've been working on similar projects on my own. So, what I came up with was this, as you see in the video, 7 segment display that displays time, uh, time until the freeze time ends, time until the round ends. It also registers skills, so if I killed this bot here, you see, you hear the beep. Uh, one thing to say about the beep is that it is a physical beeper. One would actually be on a C4. So, it's a piezoelectric beeper, works in 5 volts. It's pretty damn loud. I actually had to plug the whole of the beeper with a earplug, because your ears would be screaming by right now. So, yeah. I'm gonna demonstrate one extra feature, um, the bomb plant, so as you see if I plant the bomb, the timer will change to 40 seconds, and you hear the beeping sound. Uh, so I had to reverse the engineer the beeping sound formula, I'll post it up to GitHub, so it's not very crucial, because I could also use it without sound, but I thought it's, an, it's a pretty cool feature. Um, it has few quirks. Uh, it's it's it lacks like the bomb planter is 40 seconds. It stops at 38 seconds, but that's not the big issue. Uh, I can fix it later. So yeah. So we, as you see, the the beeper clearly overrides the game beeping sound. And yeah, as you see, after the round ends, you get the score of 1-5. So also displayed and. The final functionality is that it shows time until the freeze time ends. That's basically all I could do with this current hardware. Future updates would be adding um, the there's a the dot that uh, sinks and beeps accordingly to the C4 beep. I could do that, but I I, I was not in the mood to finish it. I could also for this hardware we could also add buttons to do some crazy shit. I'm not sure for what exactly, and I could also add lights, I could add like 10 different lights that could be controlled individually, so basically if I got a kill, I could, mm, beep all the, I could light up all the lights, but currently I feel it's pretty good after, kill, after getting a kill, because you get this beep and all segments light up. Um, so but that's basically all of the functionality here, so all the code will be posted in GitHub because there's a Arduino code part, the hardware schematics, and the Python that handles JSON messages. So I hope I will document it fully in, in the two or one or two day period. I'm having finals now, so I'm not sure if I finish, but. You can, the code will be there and the code actually works if you just comment out those uh, command, those functions who use serial library because serial library is used for communicating with Arduino so it's not it's not useful for you but uh, if you launch the Python script you will be able to see the events oh yeah there's some sort of bug so oh yeah so basically that's it uh, thanks for watching, and if you're really interested, I'll try to finish that documentation as soon as I can, so see ya!